And that started first. They were, the artists were limited to seven colors. Huh. And then I sent my design. You had 40. <laughs> had, I had quite a few. Yes. And the, the designers complained. <laughs> but her name is uh, John they, Lewis. He said, yeah. no, we're going to do this the way we presented to That's them. right. And so it got to the point where the designers wanted to start volunteering <laughs> uh, because they were learning how to stand there. Mm -hmm. Well, I start off with Q, mm -hmm. and I geometrically separate the uh, surface pattern diagonally, vertical, horizontal, and the center is where the circle comes in. And there are divisions in the picture, what I call the picture plan, that uh, objects fall on, whether it's a line or a diagonal that I place the figures on. So actually, the work is first before I do anything. It's geometrically a plane figure that I do with lines and circles and things. And then I, that's, when I apply, that's the guide I use to apply my objects on and selecting my figures. I only said one color design. And it was on watercolor, correct? And they, in, in Albert, in, I would send a pen and ink to mm -hmm. a copy of it, and then I would send the original, which was colored on top of the pen and ink. Mm -hmm. Okay. And so what would happen is, uh, and I would tell them, do whatever you want to do. And uh, they obliged me with doing what I sent the first time. Mm -hmm. Uh, and then they would do the border differently. Mm -hmm. But on the second or third edition, then they would play with the Play light. with the colors. So I had nothing to do we, with it. We have over 50 colors yes. represented in, yes. in this exhibit. Yes. Once I sent the design in, that was it. I had, I had no bearing upon other than what I had presented. And I would explain in each letter that that was the freedom that they had to play with whatever they wanted hmm. to. And they did, and, and that's it.